here in northern Uganda, the center of the Pearl of Africa, and at the center of Lao College, is the JF Kennedy Memorial Library. It was constructed in the 1960s in honor of the former U.S. President's contribution to the country. Though now in shambles, the building is regarded as one of the most significant structures in the college. The old school was a gift from the U.S. government. So in a special recognition that the library was named after John F. Kennedy. I mentally I traveled to America because we had so many American books here. I traveled to America mentally even before I reached Kampala. Those of us who worked as prefects and head librarians learned a lot about research, learned about critical thinking. I hope that... Uh... The whole students met with the board during the Easter feast to revamp the iconic building. We are marking the resurrection of Lango College. According to plans, this old structure will not be destroyed but kept monumental. The resource mobilization together with the alumni all over the world contributing and partnership with the Kennedy family as you had our resolutions and also government of Uganda since it's a government school. Within three years we should raise the money for this complex and robotics and artificial intelligence centers all in that one multi-storied building joined to the new Kennedy Library by a bridge. So this will sort of be in a sense some sort of great leap forward for yes. our people here yes. because then you'll move from really from the very bottom to something you know someplace quite high. Education is not a cost so this is an investment that at whatever cost we are going to take it because we know the impact is transformative. <laughs> Several dignitaries are planned to visit the school this year, including His Excellency the President. It will really be a game changer by inculcating the stimulation of uh, academic performance. When finally done, this will be the JF Kennedy Monument in Africa. I'm Eddie Olua, reporting for UBC News.